Pediatrics is returning to Chinese universities as an undergraduate major. The move is designed to ease a severe shortage of pediatricians. That problem will only get worse if the new two-child policy leads to a baby boom. CCTV's Wu Gaoshu reports. A sick child is any parent's nightmare. This 11-month-old baby with a tongue problem has to wait for months to see a doctor. It's indeed hard to see a good doctor. I waited for this appointment for three months. I'll have to wait another four months to see the doctor again. The health authority says there is about one pediatrician for every 2,000 kids in China. But in the U.S., the same number of kids share three doctors. The authority vows to add about 28,000 pediatricians by 2020. We will support the education ministry to cultivate undergraduate pediatrics majors, expand enrollment, and improve quality. We will increase residential pediatrician training from 4,000 every year to 5,000. After 17 years, pediatrics is returning to China's universities as an undergraduate major. From this July, eight universities will start to enroll students for this degree, starting a strong push to provide more urgently needed pediatricians with the advent of the second child policy. The country aims to ensure there is at least one university in every province offering pediatric major by 2020. But an education official says students need more incentive to take up the profession. The shortage of pediatricians is due to heavy workload, high risk, low salary, making it hard to attract graduates. Departments are working on key policies to improve the appeal of the job. With the government's big push, doctors hope they don't need to treat as many as 200 children a day. And parents like Xu hope they won't have to wait for so long for such a brief appointment. Wu Guixiao, CCTV, Beijing.